Here with the broadcast, this is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. The crowd here in anticipation of their home team Spurs in an interconference bet here at the AT&T Center in San Antonio. And back in action is Carlos Boozer. They are more than happy he's suited up and ready to play. Kevin, it's really good to have him back. I mean, they played well without him. Now the issue is, can they integrate him into what they were doing when he was gone and become even better? That's always a delicate balancing act. Yeah, they really hit on something that worked for them after he went down. And, you know, they don't want to get away from that. But if he's healthy, he's got to play a role for them. So they've got to figure out their rotation. Look at Cleveland's starting group. Adams in at shooting guard. The two stars, LeBron and Love. At the three and the four, Anderson Verajan is out there with Kyrie Irving. They set the pick. Ginobili outside. The dish now to splitter. Just five on the clock. Nobody near Parker. The 18-footer is right on the mark. Nice pass. That one was right on target. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Outside Irving. There is Zhao with a screen on Parker. Adams outside. And here's James outside. And another three for Cleveland. A good open look, and he splashes home the three. On defense, the Cavaliers. Four-point game. They come into this one after losing on Sunday. Well, Clark, they really shot terribly from downtown in that one and eventually paid the price for it. They sure did. I mean, sometimes you can make up for poor three-point shooting with a strong inside game, but theirs wasn't quite strong enough. Now here's Parker. Shoots from the line. Ferrizhow comes up with the rebound. Adams outside. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Love with the screen on Parker. Here's Adams. And another three for Cleveland. They can't afford to give him that kind of look. Well, it came off a good screen, but still, as a defender, you got to fight over the top of that. Now here's Parker. Pass to Leonard. Splitter kicks to Janot. Trills the baseline jumper. Just over two and a half minutes played here so far in the first quarter. Love with the screen on Leonard. Love dishes to Adams. Cleveland moving it around. LeBron outside. Lock at six. Adams shot is off. Nobody near him. He'll normally make that one. Leonard the pass to Parker. Uncovered. And he connects with the jumper. Parker's got his second bucket. Whatever their plan was defensively that time, it, it didn't work. Not if it results in that shot. James kicks to Verizhao. It's tipped. Ginobili with the steal. The finish throws down the breakaway jam. Great anticipation and awareness to come up with the steal and trigger the fast break. Wow, and now it's just a one-possession game thanks to that quick hitter. Fantastic basketball in the open floor. Now here's Adams. Here's Irving. And misses it off the right side of the rim. And the defense got away with a major lapse there. Leonard with no one around. And unable there to get the go-ahead bucket. Cavaliers leading. Love with the screen for Irving. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. Well, an illegal screen is one of the toughest calls for the official to make. You know, I agree with you. You've got to have some sympathy for the referees when they have to make calls like that. But they get paid well, and they're the best in the business, so they can handle it. Now here's Parker. Pass to Ginobili. There's a good screen. It's stolen by Adams, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. Boy, the kind of moments you love to see. Excellent defense leading to a dunk at the other end. Clark, you got to marvel at the transition game when they've got it clicking. It's really explosive. High octane for sure. Oof. Yeah, turning defensive pressure into offensive opportunities. That's what it's all about. And so it's San Antonio with it. The Cavaliers making the shot. Good, tough defense there. Getting a hand up, forcing that miss. 
Well, he's got the reputation of being a tough defender, and there was an example right there for you. Now, here's Adams. Five points in the game. Six to shoot. Here's Verizhao, drilled from 11 feet out. Verizhao's got his first points of the night. Spurs trail by five. Ginobili outside. The pass to Leonard. Dishes to Duncan. Fires from 14. Shot is no good. And Cleveland the other way now. Drive by Adams. And no question, he got bumped on that shot. Definitely no room for discussion on that one. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Cavaliers. Well, I'll tell you what, they must have had a good shoot around because they've been fantastic from long range so far, fellas. Yeah, their passing has been terrific, too. Clark, uh, we're seeing a lot of assists, really moving, a lot of flow offensively. I like what I see. You know, he's as close to a sure thing as you can possibly have when he steps to the line. And that one's good. Parker. Tell you what, he's three or four now. Looks like his game's on offensively. Drive by Adams. Passes it to Love. Love with the screen on Parker. Here's Irving. And another miss by Cleveland. He got the shot he wanted off that pick, just couldn't get it to fall. But Steve, they'll take that play all day long, 10 times out of 10. That was good action. Now here's Duncan. He's been patient so far, nothing yet on the scoreboard. Parker outside. Shoots from the right block, and that one's good, Duncan. Let's take a look at the players who have pulled down the most rebounds during this postseason. And you look at the Beast, third in rebounds. Inside. Boy, he has been fantastic in the playoffs. I mean, the stats prove that out. Defensively and second chance point, he's working harder than some of the other players. He's hungry for a championship, and he's playing like it. Here's Verizhao. No good. Great D that time from Leonard. Spurs trail by three. And Doris Burke caught up with Coach Greg Popovich. Doris? Coach said that as nice as it was to take home court advantage of the series, it would have been even better to keep it. He said, we know they are going to come out full throttle in this one and try to get home court advantage back. Hopefully, we won't let them. Let's watch it, guys, and see. And thank you for that, Doris. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Thompson's checked in. Cleveland's gone three or four on three-pointers in the first quarter, doing well from long range. Adams outside. Now Verizhao inside. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Verizhao's got his second basket. Look how well he led him there with that pass. Irving against Parker. Parker right side. Duncan dishes to Ginobili. 11 feet away. Misses off the left iron. You know, they've been beating this club to a lot of loose balls and rebounds here early on. Love the work ethic they've come out of the locker room with. I like the offensive awareness to exploit that lack of coverage on that play. And here is Parker following the three from Adams. Ginobili with the ball. Now guarded by Adams. Duncan, a screen. Ginobili attacking. Up loose off the pick and hammers it home. Boy, they ran a nice play there, Kevin, to um, set up the easy dunk. Yeah, he got help from his teammate and ran his man right straight into the pit. Yep, and that's the offensive player's job. That's Run right. him into the screen. And it was a great pick, too, Clark. I mean, he may have lowered his shoulder a little bit, but he got him pretty clean. So San Antonio goes with a fresh five on the floor. Cleveland also making some changes. Boozer comes in for Anderson Verja. And it's Waiters in for Irving. Boozer with a screen for James. He dishes it to Waiters. Anderson with the block. Spurs trail by seven. Now Mills. Diaw the screen. Mills passes to Diaw. The kick out to Anderson. Stolen by Boozer. And here we go with Adams running it up the court. And Clark, we saw a very animated huddle that last break, and I'm sure 
the coach wanted something specific from his team. Well, Kevin, this is certainly a key moment for the squad, and he's looking for players to lock into the new game plan and carry it out the rest of the way. That's what he's trying to get apart. Chris Middleton's checked in for LeBron. And so it's San Antonio with it. They trail by nine points. They set the pick, and Mills kicks to Anderson. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. Ran his man straight into that screen to open the lane up for the hoop. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Cleveland leading by six. Boozer with a screen for Waiters. Kicks to Boozer. Feeds to Adams. Boozer a screen on green. And Waiters has it in the corner. Gets to the corner and buries it. Waiters got six. How about the first quarter for him at the offensive end? He's really had the touch going. And Mills kicks to Green. He got right to the cup using that screen. There it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great position inside. Yeah, getting the ball into the post should be their first option every time down. Force the defense to adapt and adjust. Middleton dishes to Waiters. Cleveland moving it around. Boozer a screen on green. Six on the shot clock. Shots good by Waiters. And that's another assist for a team that is putting on the clinic on how to share the ball. I just love the mentality they've had. If a shot isn't there, they're not forcing anything. They're moving it side to side and working to get a good shot. Here's Mills. Dion Waiters making his last shot. Mills passes to Dion. Shoots from the elbow. And the Spurs scoring again. You know, of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash mouth basketball, guys. Love it. Old school. Just physical play in the paint. Dominate. Here's Middleton. He hasn't scored yet. That I'm sure will change. Stolen by Anderson. It's three on three on the fast break. Here's Green. And too long on the shot. Well contested shot there. And that's the key defensively. You've got to make them work for it, challenge every shot. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. The Cavaliers have looked good at the line. Today. They're perfect in four attempts. First free throw is good. And good on the second, so he makes them both. They've really built this lead, Kevin, at the free throw line. Thirty-two left here in the opening quarter. And Mills kicks to Green. Shot clock at six. To the left wing. The shot and blocked. In terms of rebounding, it's been a sensational opening quarter. I like sensational. That's a good word for it. Looks like they're going to have one of those days where they can do no wrong. Well, they haven't done anything wrong so far. Double-digit lead already. Here's Mills following the score by Cleveland. Green, the screen. Here's Mills. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Offline with his three. Well contested shot, and they did an excellent job of not fouling the shooter. Defense is about effort and commitment and discipline. He's a good defender because of those things. Spurs trail by 10. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. Cleveland's gone 4 of 5 from three-point land to get things going here in the first. And Adams kicks to Waiters. Rebound San Antonio. That's not a sight you see very often. I mean... He has a great feel for that jump shot, especially when he's open. San Antonio again missing. And.